हेलो हेलो नमस्कार दोस्तों मैं हूं आपका मित्र विवेक बजाज को फाउंडर स्टॉकेज और इलेम मार्केट्स का हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज अनदर फेस टू फेस इमर्ज एंड एज यूजुअल दिस इज आल्सो गोइंग टू बी विद फुल ऑफ लर्निंग एंड यू मस्ट हैव गेस्ट दिस टाइम इज गोइंग टू बी इन इंग्लिश बिकॉज माई गेस्ट इज फ्रॉम डाउन साउथ दोस्तों जो इंग्लिश uh, नहीं समझते हैं आप प्लीज कोशिश कीजिए मैं धीरे 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 ही जाऊंगा और आपको समझाने की कोशिश करूंगा आई विल ट्राई टू कन्वर्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स इन हिंदी ताकि आप ये जो डिस्कशन होने वाला है ये बहुत इम्पॉर्टेंट डिस्कशन होने वाला है एंड आई एम श्योर यू गाइज आर गोइंग टू फाइंड वैल्यू इन दिस डिस्कशन अभी क्या हो गया मार्केट के अंदर में पिछले दो तीन साल से लॉर्ड ऑफ न्यू पीपल हैव कम इन टू द मार्केट एंड ऑब्वियसली पीपल हु हैव कम इन टू द मार्केट एज फुल टाइम ट्रेडर्स Uh, believing that trading as a full time occupation can be very rewarding and it can be a long term career especially people who are working in some established companies they are living their uh, established jobs and getting into the market as full time trader to mujhe dar to lagta hai it's scary but then uh, i was trying to find out few people uh, who have done this historically and who are still into full time trading and that's their occupation i thought uh, i should uh, you know bring put forward some examples some people who have uh, been there done that and who has faced uh, problems in their life and still they have been able to succeed in the journey as a full time trader so i am very happy that i have my one of my guests for this face to face mr prince paul is from bangalore and uh, you're going to love his journey love his interactions because full time trading uh, as a Uh, as a household earning kaise karte and what should be the right strategy what are the do's and don'ts we are going to discuss with prince right here hello prince hi sir vivek ji how are you very good how are you i am also fine thank you very much for giving this opportunity <laughs> it's my pleasure thank you so much for uh, i would say grabbing this opportunity <laughs> no no it's an opportunity for me as also i, I mean uh, my sense of humor is bad so don't mind <laughs> no uh, So, Prince, uh, I, I've already laid the foundation. Uh, we people are expecting uh, what has been talked about. So, I we want to know about you. How did you start your journey? What are you doing now? A yeah. bit about your family, because I think the transition from a part-time trader to a full-time trader, family has such an important role to play. Yes. So, I would love to know about your family and how they motivated you. They allowed you to do what you are doing, and then we get into the strategies what you are following. Yes, sir. Sure. So, uh, start करने से पहले I just want to give one small fable. You know, uh, e-learn market that is the face-to-face program which you are having. The importance which it had in my life. मेरा बर्थ छोड़ दीजिए. There are many, many people, those who are, you know, blessed out of this uh, face-to-face. For that, I would like to give one small fable. You know, there was one uh, dewdrop which fell from the cloud and came mm-hmm. to the earth. and since it came out from the environment it started searching for the ocean it wanted to go to the ocean ultimate aim was to reach the ocean from there again get, go to the uh, cloud hmm. it started daily moving 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 one by one one inch one inch one inch it was struggling then one day one person came and told him are buddu what you have to do is just go try to find the nearest river that river will take you towards the ocean then this dew drop what it did was it started moving towards the river it was more easy once it reached the river it was so very confident that it will reach the ocean and start going towards the ocean mm. your face to face interview is something same like this similar like this many people sir many people who are struggling you and i many years back when i was struggling there was nothing online you know uh, you know i was struggling to search for content but then when your videos came when your interviews came there were many people whom we came to know all big big people like you know mithesh patel sir or manu bhatia or pr sundar all these people we came to know only after seeing your real and markets or your face to face interviews and then we also started uh, traveling uh, towards that journey towards the ocean finding the ocean so i should tell you the work which you're doing is excellent sir you might be so very humble so very uh, this thing but it is really helping a lot and lot of lot of people okay thank you so, thank you it was a surprise for me so thanks for this present surprise good words no, no, always this motivate is, this is a fact people. sir you should know your weightage you should know your value please don't you know don't think i mean you should expand more more that is what basic i'm trying to tell you here you should expand more you should reach out to more people that is my humble request my humble uh, wish as well yes sir i'll keep on doing that that's how we identified you as well and uh, <laughs> thank you, thank you. we want people to hear your story and get yeah. inspired 
because yes, face to face sir, sir. is not just about strategy it's about yeah, getting yeah, inspiration exactly. from people yes, who have yes, yes. been there done that chaliye sir aap yeah. apne bare mein aur bataiye aap okay sir so sir maine 2010 mein career start kiya i started with acc limited so us time jab trade i mean when a job join ke anybody if anybody was asking me uh, where you're working and all those thing i was very proud i used to tell go search in nifty 50 the top most company acc limited you can see <laughs> so that is how i was proud of uh, my company and that was when i got introduced to stock market as well uh, so orientation program mein jab bagal bagal mein everybody will give their uh, uh, interview i mean introduction and all those thing to bagal mein ek friend bola ki uh, her father is a trader he mm. just trades for 5 minutes and then after that he goes to play badminton again evening he comes back he just writes some record and all that so this made me very curious and why uh, why time pe hdfc bank ne mera first demat account bhi open karke diya so the curiosity started i also wanted to know what is the stock market what is the stock market so from there i started uh, you know understanding about stock market learning about stock market and the, the real journey started in 2015 mm. so the turning point ye tha ki i read the book rich dad poor dad mm. so in that book it was very clearly mentioned if you have to get out of your normal life that is the rat race i am no uh, you know no false thing to anyone who was working but just Uh, he had very clearly mentioned if you want to get out of the rat race try to find some at least extra 100 dollar income that is 5000 in indian currency try to find an extra 5000 income monthly this 5000 will really help you so then i started thinking what's the best solution and i found that stock market is the best thing along with work you can also start doing uh, trading and then all those things and i started doing evening trades that is in commodity crude oil and then from there i started doing lots of mistake but as always there is that uh, beginners luck i started making money as well and friends dosto agar ek advice dena to i would like to say very important thing don't trade with others money maine jo pehle jo mistake kiya wahi tha maine initially jab trading chalu kiya uh, after a small bit of glitch i started making money good money so wo money deke all the friends started giving their money also to me hmm jab dusro ka paisa lena chalu kiya it was really a you know uh, stress on your mind we have to give returns we have to show results ye wo pressure itna ho jata hai ki you can't even perform so then i would say yeah i want to talk to you about this point because it's a very important point and i don't think so anyone in my face to face ever talked about it because yes. i strongly believe in this theory what you have just said ki yes. managing your own capital is far far more easier than yes. managing other people capital because you have a fiduciary responsibility कि yes. अगर उसका पैसा लग गया तो एटलीस्ट मॉरली यू फील सो गिल्टेड बट यू नो कुछ ऐसे फेस टू फेस मैंने रिकॉर्ड किए हैं पीपल हु स्टार्टेड विद ऑलमोस्ट नथिंग फिफ्टी थाउजेंड रुपीज वन लैख रुपी एंड दे हैड अ मॉडल बट यू कॉन्ट क्रिएट अ स्केलेबल बिजनेस आउट ऑफ दैट फिफ्टी थाउजेंड लैख ऑफ रुपी देन ऑब्वियसली यू नीड सम मोर कैपिटल एंड यू कॉन्ट एक्सपेक्ट पीपल टू गिव यू लोन टू ट्रेड राइट Yes. so finally people do go to known people and manage their capital because finally you want to reach that magical 1 crore capital as fast as possible to yes. to see an absolute return ki itna rupya bach raha hai nahi to 1 yes. lakh rupaye mein kuch bachega nahi 1 crore mein agar lakh rupaye bachte hain to you feel value of your time so i want your reaction on this statement which i have made sir so पहले आपने जो पॉइंट बताया था ना सर कि कैपिटल दैट इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दैट द ड्रीम ऑफ मेकिंग वन सी आर दैट कम्स टू एवरी वन दैट इज वाई दे स्टार्ट टेकिंग टू मच ऑफ रिस्क लिवरेज नॉल इसके लिए मेरा एक ही एडवाइस है एटलीस्ट टेक ट्रेडिंग फॉर यू नो थ्री इयर्स और फोर इयर्स एज अ डिग्री इफ एट ऑल यू आर पासिंग योर थ्री इयर्स फोर इयर्स डिग्री दैट इज ट्रेडिंग इफ एट ऑल यूर सक्सेस आफ्टर दिस थ्री इयर्स फोर इयर्स देन यू कैन स्टार्ट यू नो बोरोइंग मनी और यू कैन टेक people will be back of you after that if you are making regular returns people will be back of you to give more and more money but mm. this 3 years degree completing the degree is very very important that is nothing but 3 years you have to be successful in stock market mm. so this is what i would say okay got your point so karna hai paisa logo ka manage is not a problem but wo 3 saal ki degree karke yes, aap exactly. utarega isme that I, yeah. i i accept i take your point yes theek hai aage badhte hain so that was where uh, so jab maine uh, as a, as i told you i started taking others money from there my downfall started again in trading so uh, pressure started building up uh, expectation because you know i was uh, good at work i was uh, good at academics everything was good but suddenly abhi aisa situation aa gaya ki people are asking you for money calling you for money and you can't be a defaulter uh, you will have a very good name in the society you will have very respectable position and then when you suddenly not able to give them money the returns your yeah. confidence will come down so yeah. this is yeah. where i even i did a mistake then 
the role of family was very very important during this particular period as you told it's very very important my wife really helped me my mother also helped me my brother also helped me i was able to come up and let me tell you i am one of the you know uh, most luckiest person on earth because my friends also supported me it is not that they were coming and torturing me or you know hitting me bashing me or all <laughs> when <laughs> they had trust on me basically is it because my innocence or pata nahi kya hai they had so much of trust on me they like prus chalega yaar aur ek saal lekar theek hai chalega but internally i had that conflict opus dena hai paisa opus karna hai and all those things then somehow maine personal loan leke sabka i gave off everybody's money back i had a good paying job i was working in a very good company so i paid i took a personal loan cleared off everyone's money back and i decided okay i will trade with only my capital so then this is how i learned a very good lesson so i would say you also please don't do this mistake if at all you want to learn something from me and then uh, from 2017 i should say during that period started trading with my own money started gradually increasing step by step step by step compounding kept on adding capital as well and during 2019 period 2020 period i came into options so once i came into options the drawdown completely reduced so i'm not saying that you have to do only option selling as any sir kyunki mera strategy aisa hai ki i do buying and selling also but i'm just trying to tell you selling reduced my drawdown curve the equity curve jo bhi hai it was not going down no much fluctuation so from 2019 i have been completely making consistently profit i have been living out of trading during this particular time there was even this corona lockdown all those things and i had a twin during that particular time and we used to not get any servants to take care of them so then we decided okay wife and me we both of us will take a risk we'll do work from home so she also to apply for work from home i applied for work from home i did not get because my job required me to run around i was a business manager of bangalore so i could not work from home so then i took a risk my wife told me at that time i really remember now also you don't worry if at all if any expense is required i am there i will help you or worst to worst case we will pledge our gold and all this so this oh kind God. of backup was there back backup was there for me and i was paid very good salary at that that time Uh, at, um, i was at around 31 years during that particular time and i spent very good salary it was very difficult to give up that salary but then i thought okay we'll take a risk i will live my childhood again i will grow along with my kids i can play with my kids so then uh, i jumped into full time trading and it has been uh, rewarded very well uh, after jumping into full time trading the returns has increased more and more because we are able to analyze the market more nicely and trade more nicely uh so this is how is my journey sir till now nice 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 very good prince and, and one common thing which we share is that you have three kids and i have also three yeah. kids and i remember distinctly when my twin boys were born in 2013 uh that is the time when i changed my tangent and i said that no more full time intense trading now i want to become more of a passive trader and i want to build business rather than just being a trader so when did that uh, did that uh, uh, having three kids also influenced you in some way yes yes, yes. so so mm-hmm. mine was double double effect ek to corona lockdown and second was uh, twins so both of this and also uh, deep down in my uh, i mean conscious i had that uh, fire telling me that yes i can do full time trading i can make more returns if i concentrate more towards trading so this also all together fueled me to take this bold it's decision. a it's a very bold step huh? it's a very yeah. bold step with three yeah. kids and, uh, and sir and since you told this since whoever is planning to come to full time trading let me tell you the monthly salary will not come so be make sure that you have a backup your wife has to give you your salary or somebody has to give a salary otherwise you can't come into full time trading there will yeah. be months when there will be there will be no income from trading two three months draw down and all those things so you have to be very ready for this yes that's the i think the very important in bold italics and bold and everything that yes, yes. <laughs> you need to have that uh, comfort of it. having yeah. a recurring income from some source to run your household yes chale prince good to uh-huh. good to know you good to know about you chale ab andar chalte hain aap kar kya rahe exactly what is the strategy you are using okay sir uh, i am trading now full time into bank nifty options okay. because i have tried out every other options and i felt bank nifty is very comfortable and i also decided one more thing if you keep watching bank nifty always that is if you can master bank nifty you will know everything bank nifty will start talking to you that is what i believe yeah. so daily in and out you keep seeing bank nifty trading only bank nifty then you will come to know every moment of bank nifty and it will be so comfortable for you so that's why from past 2 to 3 years i'm only doing bank nifty okay i i do both directional as well as non directional okay. because you know many people come and say uh, non directional people make more money some people come and tell directional people make more money option buyers make more money yeah. so why, why 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 should you have such kind of bias yaar yeah? when market is there you know market is going up 
or down, you take a directional trade. When market is going sideways, you take a non-directional trade. So this is my uh, this is my concept which I am following, and I'm I have made a clear cut system for that, and I'm following that system blindly, and it is giving me very good res- returns. Great. So let us uh, go deep inside your system and your sure, sure. psychology and the setup. So you yes, can sir. share your screen. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. So uh, the strategy name which I've kept is called as King Strategy. Yeah. So uh, I, I always believe like even when I was working also, what I believe is always make your work atmosphere or your wherever you are, make it more entertaining so that you won't get bored. Mm. So when, when I was working with ACC also, my team also has to always keep them very, you know, happy, jovial kind of thing. It has helped, helped me in many things and that there were disadvantages as well. Same with the case with trading as well. So in trading, I'm trying to keep this, my strategy with full kind of characters. So it's going to be like a South Indian movie, you know, re- recent KGF also you would have seen lots of characters coming and going, coming and going. Same like this, you'll find a lot of characters in my uh, strategy as well. So the benefit of this is, you know, uh, sometimes when I'm playing with my kids or taking care of the kids, I project the screen on the TV. Even if I'm looking that side, this side, my wife will tell, Are king is getting ready, Are queen is getting ready, go take action. So this, you know, it becomes like a full entertainment and you won't get bored trading. And let me tell you, trading is like, you know, uh, trading from home, trading alone is like a boring business. You are alone, you're only looking into the system full time. You have no one to talk, no one to share. So it is very important that you keep your moral also very high, your happiness very high. You have to be very confident. Okay, so that is why I kept the name as uh, King Strategy. Uh, I'll try to introduce you all the characters. It's not going to be very, very difficult. It's it's a very clear cut, uh, clear cut, robust system. That's what I would like to say. Sure. So I already told about uh, myself. So <laughs> yeah, let me just uh, deep dive into the strategy. So uh, there is a very famous uh, tagline which you, you all would have heard. Why should only option buyers have all the fun? Or I can ask you a question. Why should only option sellers have all the fun? Yeah. <laughs> so be both. You can trade both and it's not going to be difficult. You can do both. And that is what this uh, entire strategy is all about. So uh, this is a directional and a non-directional uh, trading strategy. So automatically when you start, I'll show you how do I find out the direction or not, and uh, how do I come to know whether market is non-trending. So if at all you do the chart analysis, you will come to know the chart will start speaking to you. And then accordingly, we will try to take action. So uh, when the market opens, I'll be starting off with a straddle or a strangle. So when do I start with the straddle and when the start of the strangle is because uh, Fridays, usually when the uh, VIX is, I mean, non-directional theta is going to be very, very less. So then I go for strangle because I don't want to take a uh, risk with the straddle. So depending on that, you can take a straddle or a strangle, doesn't matter. If you're comfortable with the straddle, you can continue with straddle itself. So what I do is market opening, you can t- I take a straddle and then I wait for the market to give a direction. So how I get the direction, that is what we are going to learn next. So to find the direction, I use two parameters. So again, you all know that uh, all the indicators are going to be lagging. And then there are many indicators which are going to be uh, leading as well. So for me, the leading indicator is going to be price action. So how do I find the price action? How do I find out whether where the resistance and where the support is? That is going to be completely on price action. And the second thing is the uh, lagging indicator, which is nothing going to be the RSI, which I'll be using. So when we combine this both, we are having something, uh, you know, we are somewhere in the middle. We are not very leading, neither we are lagging. We are somewhere in the middle and we're getting confirmation from both. And then accordingly, we are going to trade this. Okay. So the price action, as I told you, we are going to find out the support and the resistance zones at which there is going to be a potential breakout. Okay, so support and resistance zones, you all be knowing there be that, that this is a particular area where there's going to be a lot of buyers, a lot, a lot of sellers, so that be big institutional funds. That is what many people say. So this, uh, this is the area where a lot of uh, call writing or put writing also will be happening. So what I have done is to find out the king candle. So let me tell you what's a king candle first, okay? So this is the first character just coming into the strategy. That is nothing but the king candle. So what's the king candle? The condition number one is that it should have the highest high compared to the left and the right assistance. So this, when you compare to a king, if at all you visualize a king, you can see that a king will be having an assistant to the right and the left. You can see that with the fan, they'll be standing to the right and the left. Yes. That is what I'm. <laughs> so that is what I'm just trying to bring in here, pictureize here. So here also our candle, the king candle should have the highest high and it should have an assistant to the left side. It should have an assistant to the right side. Forget about the low, forget about the color, forget about all those things. Just compare only the three highs. 
So basically what it means is in your talk in a uh, technical term, there's nothing but a pullback happening or you can call it as a head and shoulder kind of model pattern, anything of that sort. Basically, it is having a very good pullback from this level. That is what we are trying to find out here. Okay, so one more example which I've kept here, you can see here. Uh, initially, there was a bullish candle, then you can see it is trying to reverse and then it has come down. So this center candle is our king candle. So once our king is formed, what next duty for us is to draw a line above the king. Okay. Okay. Uh, one more condition I missed out. Okay. Second condition is the RSI. It should be greater than 60 or equal to 60. Okay. So most of the time you will get this uh, candles very soon in the chart, but then you just have to patiently wait for a RSI all, also. So if RSI is above 60, it means that the market is going to be bullish. If it is below 40, it means that market is going to be bearish. So between 60 and 40 is where I'll be playing the non straddle. Okay. So now comes the entry condition condition. If any candle closes above the king candle, it is called as a bull candle. So that is the second character coming in the strategy. It is called as the bull candle. I'll just show you an example here. You can see here. So we have here one candle here, second candle here, which is having the highest high when compared to the left and the right. And then you can also see RSI is above 60. So above 60, I kept it as green color. So now you can see this is the king candle high point and I have drawn a line on the king point. So if any candle closes above this, it is called as a bull candle and that is nothing but the uh, market is trying to tell you that the market is bullish. From here onwards, we can change our bias. We are no longer non-directional. We are going to be bullish. That is what is the chart going to tell us at this particular point. Now the execution is very smart, which I've done. Okay, this is very important. If, if at all you are not in good in options, you'll be getting a little confused. But just try to uh, look into it twice or thrice, you'll understand this. What I do is, so initially at 9.20, I'm in a straddle. Let's say at 9.20, 9.30, I start my trading. I'm in a straddle. I sell a call. I sell a put. This is nothing but a straddle. That is non-directional. So when I get a king candle, what I do is smartly, I just buy two calls. So when I buy two calls, what happens? The call sell will get squared off and it will become one call buy and one put sell. So this is nothing but synthetic futures. So hope I'm not going above the head. Yeah, yeah, no, absolutely fine. Yeah. So what happens is now you are completely bullish. So you don't have the fear about, uh, you know, losing your theta DK if you are buying options or all those things, or if you're selling options, you don't have to worry about et cetera, et cetera, whatever concerns are there. Here, what I'm doing is smartly from a non-directional, I am just converting myself into a directional trade now. So, so now you are saying that you will start with a non-directional. Uh, yes, at 920, 920, and yeah. The 920. Yeah. And the moment uh, King Candle comes and there is a close above the King Candle. So when you're looking at King Candle close, is it what is the time of the candle you're looking at? Any time. See, uh, the time frame which I'm using is five minute time frame. That is five suitable minutes. for intraday. Yeah. So because so five minutes, candle, that's why five minutes. Five minutes, yeah. So okay. any candle which closes above this king candle, that is nothing but the bull has arrived. When the bull is arrived, you can go bullish. So we can just wait for the close of the candle. Once mm. the candle gets close, I'll just show you an example. Yeah. So you can see here, once the candle closes above the king candle. So this is the time when we go bullish. So till then you can see uh, there were few structures as well, but RSI was supporting only over here. So this particular point, you can see king is formed. It has got a left and a right assistance. And when these two assistants are there and the when the when the bull is closing above the king candle, you can enter, uh, you can take this execution that is by two calls. So when you trade manually, your execution also is very, very important. You won't have time to close both the call and put and you can't square off and then again take a directional trade and all those things. So smart work is just buy two calls, automatically it will become the straddle. Okay. So now, yeah, and one more thing is that this is like very, uh, you know, uh, aggressive kind of method. That is like your profits also be very high, your loss also very be high. So if in case you're not ready to take such kind of risk, you can do your only directional selling options at this particular time. There are many probabilities, mix and matches, which you can do with this. It's not that you should buy two calls only. You can only go, if at all you feel like doing only non-directional trading, uh, sorry, option selling, you can continue by selling the put option. It will go as per the direction. So okay. then what happens if you do only option selling, your risk also will reduce. In this case, we are taking a synthetic future. So the returns is almost going to be bigger than options as well. It is going to be same as futures, but advantage is that your transaction costs are less and the execution cost also is less. The time taken for the switching from a straddle to non, I mean, non-directional trade also, the time taken is very less. That's the main idea of taking the straddle. Sure. 
Okay, so this is uh, one example. Okay, second one more example. Let me just show you. Uh, so I think, uh, yeah, over here we can see a king and then we get a breakout. Uh, we go in the direction of the market. So market will speak to you at that particular time you can take. So one more example, let me show you here. You can just see a small spike. It is above 60 and here also there is a king candle which is formed here. Then the bull candle has formed. After that, you can see market has continuously gone up. Okay, so that is about the uh, setup which I'm following. That is the king setup. That is market is going to be bullish. So that is king is ready and the bull is ready. We go directional. And very important thing is the risk management. The stop loss is nothing but the low of the king candle. Okay. We have to be very, very careful with your breaks. Please don't go uh, continuously without stop losses. We have to trade with stop loss. That is nothing but the low of the king candle. So you can see this is the king candle which is formed here. The low of this is going to be the stop loss. Sure. Uh, trailing stop loss also I use that is nothing but the super trend with setting 10 comma 3. So in sure. such cases like when market is going continuously in our favor, you can trail it with the super trend. So when the super trend changes the color, then you can exit your position. And once again, you can come back to non-directional trading and then wait for a direction. Then again, you know, if you're a full-time trader, you can keep doing like this. Keep mm. fluctuating from directional to non-directional. You can keep doing it. Okay. So that's what I told you. So if stop loss hits, trailing stop loss hits, you can sell two calls. So that the position comes back to a straddle. That is nothing but just the reverse of what you have done here. So from here, again, if you sell two calls, you will come back to a straddle. So you can do that kind of uh, smart work. You will come back into uh, your non-directional trading. So Q uh, that is about the bullish setup. Now comes the Q in. Uh, so again, this is opposite, just opposite of the king. Nothing but the bearish. All conditions are going to be the same, but the queen candle should uh, have the lowest low. Just like how King was having the highest high. So you can see here, uh, Queen should have the lowest low. Simple. Okay. And second condition is that uh, the RSI should be less than 40. These are the two conditions. One is price action. Second is uh, RSI uh, indicator. So, uh, so you can see here, the, this candle, the center candle is having an assistant to the left and the assistant to the right. And the lowest, the, it is having the lowest low. So once this candle is formed, this is the Queen candle, which is ready. We are drawing a line below this and after this we will wait for any candle to close below this and once it closed below this it's going to be bearish after this we are bearish just like how we did the synthetic future we can do same synthetic future in this as well so the money management part this also many people will ignore it's not that you should trade with 30,000, 50,000 kind of thing 2 lakhs is compulsory required for doing this uh, strategy. That is for uh, trading one lot of uh, straddle, uh, synthetic future or whatever it is. One, uh, 2 lakh is compulsory must. And maximum stop loss is going to be 2.5% for the day. Because this is a game of probability, don't expect to have everyday profit because you're even doing option buying as well. So the main thing is here, uh, whenever you make loss, limit your loss to 2.5%. That is with the 2 lakh capital, you're going to lose only 5,000 rupees. But when you get profits, the profits will be big. The ratio, the risk reward ratio is going to be very big. So this money management is very, very important. You have to follow this. Don't trade with 1 lakh or 50,000 and all those things with the strategy. So this is uh, all about my strategy. So this is what very I've been following for my bread and butter daily. <laughs> Don't tell me. I mean, you've been following this for how long now? Almost, I should say, two and a half years. 2019 and uh, started off with this. And you have shared that strategy with us. This is so yes. generous of you. Sir, you. Uh, the thing is, uh, you know, you, all, you already know that just by teaching a strategy, you know, everybody can't follow it. There are many more things behind this. Yeah. Risk management, money management, psychology. So I don't mind sharing my strategy with, you, uh, with anyone. Yeah. Until, yeah. Unless it's helping somebody. Uh, you know, it's very, it's going to be very, and options also has got a lot of liquidity. So no worry about. Yeah. <laughs> so, Correct. So, yeah. so tell me, Prince, I have a couple of questions uh, related uh -huh. to this. So one is that you use five minute chart. Yes. So if, suppose I want to trade this strategy for few days. Yes. So what duration of chart should I look at? Sir, one hour, one hour would be decent enough. Okay. And can I use the same strategy for one hour chart? Yes, you can do it from an hour chart also. But I, I am personally, if at all you are asking me, uh, I, I am completely against this overnight risk. Okay. So that is why I prefer, I mean, I only do intraday. I don't do positional. Positional, I just have long-term uh, funds only and small amount of capital allocation for swing trading. But uh, I'm, I am against the risk. That's the main thing. Okay. And when you trade options intraday, uh, you trade every day. 
Yes, every day. So what is what was the success of this strategy? Sir, I've been doing this from past one and a half years, and uh, I'm having almost fifty five percent accuracy in this. With <clears throat> one is to two, one is to two risk reward. Okay. Yeah, and uh, yeah, this this also I have to say very important. Many people will uh, looking at the strategy will jump into it, but let me tell you, be ready for this. Fifty uh, percent accuracy. Don't even think that you will get continuous profits and all those things. Fifty percent accuracy above fifty percent accuracy is very good, which many people don't accept it. Uh, so be ready for that. Drawdowns will be there. You now, presently, you all know market is very sluggish, moving sideways. So we have to accept the stop loss. But the beauty is, market will tell you it is non-directional. So most of the time, you can limit your loss and you can uh, make profit from non-directional as well. So how do you identify this king strategy? Because you are only looking at Bank Nifty. You are yes. able to see king and queen. Yes, yes. Otherwise, I am able to see where it is uh, responding, where is it jumping, where is the breakouts happening. So I am able to see. Uh, however, Bank Nifty moves, I am able to identify. That's how I got this uh, method. But you can create an algorithm which can scanner which yes, can yes. tell you this is happening. Yes, yes, we can do algo also because the rules are very clear and strict. The thing is, if you do algo, many people, uh, my friends, relatives like told me that you can do algo. I, you know, the thing is, uh, I might feel. Uh, You know, somehow I might lose the uh, control over the market. That's what I'm feeling. So because if algo is there, you just operate the algo on the algo, and you'll go be- become busy somewhere else. You won't get the feel of reading the charts. You won't know how Bank Nifty is. It's something like telling you, you know, your son is growing in a boarding school. You only know that result is coming. He's getting good grade and all those things, but you don't know his development. So that is why that is my opinion. It is not that because I have the luxury of sitting full time in front of the screen, uh, but you can do algo because rules are very clear cut, strict rules. Okay. And how has been last uh, two three months, sir? I should say from uh, April I made, ended up in profit. Uh, May now as of now I'm in drawdown. Okay. Luckily, and luckily, out, uh, yeah. out of this, let's say out of twelve months, how many months will be lo- in loss drawdown? Sir, I would have liked to show my uh, PNL as well. Almost all the months I'm in profit. Okay. <laughs> so that's that nice. again God's grace. It's not luck. It's God's grace. I would say. And uh, May month, as of now, is in drawdown, but I'm sure another 15 days is there. Uh, we can recover it. And I also one more thing which I forgot to tell you, sir. Uh, I always look into a quarterly performance because I was handling a company. Uh, I'm also responsible for this uh, ACC report and all those things. So from that, it came as a practice. I only look into quarterly report. I don't believe in this monthly report because even big when big big companies don't look into monthly reports, they per, they show only the quarterly. Why do traders look into their daily profits, monthly profits? I don't understand. So please look into your quarterly performance. It will change your attitude towards trading. Okay, and uh, when you uh, when you were developing the strategy, yes. I'm sure you must have rejected few. You must have accepted few, and finally you developed this. Yes. How did you reach at this strategy? Okay, so for uh, first initially, like as always, straddle. That was what I was following. Straddle, cut one leg and go when the market goes in direction. But then. that was somehow not satisfying because when you know that the market is talking to you market is giving you indication then why only believe in this uh, 920 straddle where just uh, keep a fixed stop loss and fixed target i mean cut your legs and all those things then i started using indicators which was rsi so rsi will clearly tell you about 60 up upar jana hai niche and all those things but uh, price action was very very important so then i added price action i tried out many indicators but i felt these two are giving very good returns uh, price action and rsi okay so it was evolution evolution yes and uh, how long you think this strategy will help you with the bread and butter how long sir this strategy has to work always that is hmm. i don't find because as you know it's a game of probability as long as my risk reward is more than 1 is to 1 even if i'm tossing a coin i'm getting 50% accuracy over the long run that is very hmm. important just don't trade one week one month just trade for long run and if you're having an accuracy more than 1 is to 1 you will make profit end of the day So, what do you do after market hours? <laughs> Same like you, sir. Kids, three kids, kids now at home. Three kids at home. So, <laughs> and I'm playing. Yeah. No pressure of targets and no business. No pressure of targets. No pressure of uh, anything. I I should really tell. I'm living my childhood now. I'm playing with my kids now. I want to uh, join them to swimming classes. So, I'm thinking I'll also go join with them swimming classes. Next, I have many more plans for them. Along with them, I am also planning to do all those things. so that is that is this is all because of trading i should tell you try to you know you should have aspiration to become a full time trader it will really allow you to live your childhood once again yeah so how long will a person take to become a consistent full time trader sir as i told you 3 years is a must 
you think it as a degree don't even even if you're successful for one year which happened to me i i took it to my head thinking that i was successful trader starting all this money don't think you know three years is a must sometimes you might say four five years but three years is must in this three years you should become successful you should be making money consistently then only you can say you're a successful trader and you can jump you can take the risk and also main condition you need to have a supportive wife <laughs> that's, that's yeah. true and uh, what what do they your parents uh, tell you are they happy Sir, with what you are doing uh initially i don't have father i took up responsibility of family almost when i was 8 years old oh. so then uh, mother uh, usually she listens to me as well i've been like uh, taking care of the family so they had no issue mother had no issue with this uh, my brother also i taught him trading so he is also now full time trading he also has quit his job from a very good company wow so now i'm yeah <laughs> so my entire family also now we are like moving towards trading all are like convinced about trading That's awesome it. and your brother trades with you or he no no, no 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 he stays with my mother he stays okay. separately he trades separately all of you are in bangalore all in bangalore yeah. awesome yeah i mean that is i think the beauty of bangalore when i was talking to manu yeah. and i realized that that <clears throat> systematic rule based trading with a defined process Yes. So that that is something which has come so naturally inside all of you in Bangalore because a I have seen people from down south they are much more structured in their actions yeah. and uh, obviously uh, the, the, you always try to find reasons of why this is happening whereas yeah. in north generally people are impulsive not that i want to you know give hey sir ab aisa mat bolye then our crowd is pan indian crowd they'll have bias again <laughs> no 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 there is a, so people know me i mean uh, okay. i have uh, you know i i i'm pretty much neutral about everyone but generally i have seen that correct, correct. people in north are much more aggressive that's aggressive. their style and yes. people in south are much more conservative and more systematic correct. oriented correct correct And, and along with this, along with this, Rich Dad, I read one more book that was uh, Discipline Trader. That actually yeah. really helped me not blowing out my account. Yeah. Otherwise, most of them who have started trading career would have blown their account two times, three, uh, three times. I luckily did not blow out my account. That was because I had the habit of reading. I read this uh, two books which changed my life. Awesome, awesome, superb, Prince. <laughs> Thank this you. Was, this was this was short, sweet, and yeah. very effective. Uh, uh, I have done big, big, big videos, but this this whole sharing which you have given to us today is so peaceful, and it clearly come across your expressions also that yes. you are using it, making money, and you are happy about living your life the way you are living it. Yes. Thank you I so would, much. I would, I would say everyone also to experience the same happiness. <laughs> Absolutely, and I am sure people will get inspired. And uh, Prince, you are active on Twitter by any chance? Uh, no, sir, I am. Uh, I am not active on Twitter. good for you <laughs> <laughs> that means you really you really are following that after market i want to spend time yes. with kids rather yes. than i don't even use my laptop mobile nothing i got hell I was in a corporate company so i got hell lot of torture so complete <laughs> no to everything yeah <laughs> awesome i mean it's such inspiring to hear from you and i'll meet you when i'm in bangalore next sure, sure. it's my pleasure and we'll catch up yeah. thank you so much for this content yes, Thank you, sir. Thank so, you. So, friends, I hope you enjoyed this. I thoroughly enjoyed this simplicity, but effectiveness. वो कहते हैं ना कि सादा जीवन उच्च विचार, जो गांधी जी कहते थे कि live a simple life, but then live with fullest. So, this is what Prince is doing. Selected a path for himself, finding out the right corner, and then living that corner in the most effective manner. आप भी कर सकते हैं, Prince कर सकते हैं तो खाली बस थोड़ा discipline और थोड़ा समझ और better चाहिए. Thank you for being there with me. and keep supporting us bye bye take care